Welcome back. Welcome back. Good enough. Good enough. Welcome back. Good enough. Good enough. Welcome back. Quick. Boom. Welcome. All right. Good to see you. Good to have me. We had to Good to have it. you. We had to stop it. We had to start it. Okay, here we go. This is what I just uncovered. I, I need to know. Hurry. There is Hurry seconds. this. Okay. It's a spe- This is the real. We're starting off with the real episode 27. My favorite number, 27. 27. I love I just, that number. I just blew my mind. Look at I'm starting. I started writing notes, and I got to okay. the last one. I said, I got to find at least one thing more to, to, to read about, and it, it's the best one. Blew my mind. Okay. Okay. I'm okay. Ready. There's you this. You were doing it. I, I got a little stuck. I got stuck in like a vortex. Okay. I, was, I, was, I don't know what was happening, and then you there is this broke me out of it. Weird uh, chain of resorts. Okay. It is a billion-dollar company started in Spain, and they call it a... Uh, like uh, I forgot the word for it. I just did like a whole little crash course in it. Okay, it's okay. like uh, Carnival Cruises. Okay, it's a resort. Okay, company they put together okay. timeshare. Kind more like vacations. Okay, but it's like a uh, like when you go to Vegas now. A lot of the a lot of the the casinos are owned by the same people, so you can get okay. the same food, you get the right. same rewards card, all that shit. So it's the same thing with vacations. Okay, there's this uh, vacation group. Right. Okay. Okay. It's I don't know how to say it. Guapo. Guapo. Something. Yeah, and they have like, like two hundred and fifty resorts. Okay, in the Dominican Republic, which is down there by Florida. I'm listening. Okay. okay. There have been two couples, two black couples. Right. Okay. Black woman, black man. Okay. First one got run off the road. They found them both dead. One of them was floating around in the ocean. Second one, they found another couple, like a, a month later, found them dead in their rooms by respiratory failure. And they had high blood pressure. There was uh, some oxycodone in the room. Whoa. Okay. Then there is this crazy white lady that the story comes out that she tried to sue or she tried to like kind of blackmail the resort saying that she was resort she was chilling vacation mm-hmm. okay. somebody ran it from behind smacked her pulled her in one of the rooms wearing the uniform of the resort okay and beat the fuck out of her for hours right and oh. she put her picture up on there right and then they're trying to spin the story like this bitch is trying to blackmail us for money. And she's putting up this horrible picture online. I mean, God, anyone would look bad if you did that. But they're not saying that in that same resort chain, right? Maybe on a different island, but still really close in the same owners. Okay. These two couples have been fucking killed in the last month, in the last year. So they got their... There is some wild don't going go on. on. Don't go on vacation with Guapo Wapo, dog. Let me look it up so I know the real name. <laughs> it's fucking oh, crazy. That, How do you like yeah, that for I think a I fucking saw the, rabbit hole, dude? Uh, yeah, I think I saw the picture of that girl. Uh, she got fucked up. She got fucked up, and everybody's like, oh, you're just trying to get money. It's like... It money seems from who? From the... From the, from the guapo wapo? Mm-hmm. From the... She's trying to blackmail the hotel, but... Uh, you don't think it's just... Uh, is foreigners, I don't, foreigners I don't. taking advantage of the white lady? Uh, how are you going to take advantage of something when you get fucking killed with your woman, dog, on the way to the airport? How are you going to... Well, that, well, yeah. Uh, it seems like they don't care if you're black or white because the white lady got her ass. She got the, well, she was, she, they thought she they probably thought she was dead. No, they, Well, yeah, they probably thought she was dead. Yeah, yeah. Maybe she played dead. Yeah. She said for hours. Probably unconscious. They didn't say if they were what she was asking. Maybe she was at, they were asking her something. Like, how fucking crazy is that, dude? Let me let me find this. Let me find this. I'm sorry. Okay. All right. Yeah, All right. I really have to find the name of the, the hotel. Yeah. Or not the name of the people that own it, dude. Right. Don't go there. Don't be walking any in on the hallway uh in the hallways. By yourself. By dude. yourself. Yeah. yeah. What are you doing walking on a freeway bridge? Wow, dude. Shout out. That's crazy, man. That is crazy. Whoa. Yeah. Uh, oh my so God. they're going to keep... Um, so I don't know. I don't know the full story. I just know that that is really odd. Seems crazy. And she yeah. definitely said it was a... She was dressed in the hotel thing. Oh, yeah. You can't go to Hawaii either, man. You see those people dying in Hawaii? No. What? 
they, well, I don't know if they're dying, but they have they like that weird um, parasite. There's some weird, there's some weird parasite. Like people go to Hawaii and then they go in the ocean or something, or and they, and they're they're over there in the islands, you know. Okay. And they're contracting this weird illness. Really. Yeah, parasite. Hawaii parasite. Look that up. That's a good one. <laughs> Hawaii parasite. Hang on, I'm just trying to find it. No, it doesn't matter. Here, here. I, okay, go. Here we Tell go. Me what, what else so, yeah, on that's there? some crazy ho. That's crazy Hello. hotel shit. And They're going to kill him. We are ready. I got a joke for you. Okay. Okay. Your nose can't be 12 inches long, or else it would be a foot. <laughs> Boom. Next on the list. Uh, ooh, here we go. Hashtag censorship in the desert. Oh God! Tell me what yeah, you know about dude. it. Tell me. Okay, okay, okay. Break okay. it down I, because I break down. Look, the, uh, you got to break down the whole thing. Okay, yeah, I will. I will Let okay. me find this guapo wapo. This thing. is this is crazy, man. So there's a lot of. Uh, I wanted to go to this thing, right? This this uh, contact in the desert, mm-hmm. which is a convention that happened, and I didn't go. Because I couldn't afford it because it's too expensive. It's really expensive. So, How crazy is but that? Weird, huh? I wanted to go. And anyways, there was a bunch of different people that went there, and then they were speaking about aliens. Right. And The guy. The, but the thing that I wanted to say was that the guy, one of the guys that was there got his, they were recording everybody, and they cut his, uh, they cut his audio or something. They were making everybody's thing into fucking DVDs, and they didn't make his, and they fucked up his DVD whenever, whatever he was talking about. And the guy, what's his name? Uh, Jordan uh, Sather. Jordan Sather. Jay Sather. Yeah, you look yeah. at that guy up, that guy. And what? Uh, well, he has, he's been doing it for a while, but I think a lot of people know about him, right? Yeah, I can't find the guy, whatever. Look up Guapo Wapo, <laughs> woman beaten. In the Dominican Republic, and you got to do a little research <laughs> and find the damn resort that you can't go. But it's a Spanish resort, and they posted a billion dollars last year. I'm not year. doing it. I'm not going to Colombia. I'm not Don't doing it. Don't go to Dominican Republic and stay at the Guapo nope. Wapos, dog. Don't do it. Okay. Don't do it. That's good. Um, That's the sad. Jordan Slathery thing. Yeah, yeah. They have the UFO. Yeah, whatever his name the is. Uf- uh, the UFO yeah, dude. convention. They're recording everybody. They're recording everything. What's the purpose of that fucking convention? It's for disclosure. It's for information release. And this guy's talking about something and moderated. Moderated. You're gonna, someone's going to... Special interest group. Coming in. Coming in. Don't talk about that. You're talking about it or you're not making no DVD for you? Who do you think you are? Ah, you explained it so bad. I'm sorry. I'm right. really stoned. You explained it so shitty. Help All me right. out. Help me out. Jordan Slathery was a guy explaining <laughs> uh, his theory about something. I don't know exactly what. I wasn't there. And right. But he, he, he was talking about different. At Contact in the Desert, they record everything. They put out an official DVD. On the official DVD of Contact in the fucking Desert, Right. for some reason, it's, when he comes up, his audio is completely cut. Completely. It's just out of there. Just out of there. Right. Completely. He complains, like on Twitter or something, uh-huh. one of the people from the convention goes, well, you dropped the F-bomb. Yeah. So we had to cut it. Some guy told me that we don't, you know, we got to have good language. So yeah, instead of cutting just, a, instead of bleeping that or just, they yeah. obviously have the, the fucking capacity to mute it. Instead of just muting him when he said fuck or whatever. Right. They mute his whole thing. So then he goes right back at him, Jordan Slathery right. or Slather, whatever his name. Yeah. He tells him, wouldn't it be something if... If I had my own audio recording. If I had my own my, audio recording and it's my definitely whole speech. clean, I never said fuck. And I never said the F word. Wouldn't that be something if it if it leaked? Yeah, it'd be really weird if that leaked out. Yep. Woo! David Wilcock is a shill. David Wilcock is a shill. Okay, opify. Opify him. Opify him. Okay. Uh, Jordan, Damn, that dude. Jordan Slather guy, he was one of the first... Are one of the big guys uh, to do the he, Above Majestic movie. Yeah, okay. And that was when he was cool with David Wilcox. Dog, do well, you think they, they get you? They get yeah. you at some point. Yeah. Always? Yeah. Well, who do you want to, you know what I mean? Who do you want to, who do you like listening to? You know what I mean? 
Joe Rogan? Opified. Opified. Who do you like listening to? They're going to get you with that one. That's what it is. And so people, David Wilcox talking about like, I don't know about you, but I can't wait till we get to the fifth dimension and we have telepathy and we have telekinesis. And I don't know about you, but I can't stand all this uh, cruelty and humanity and uh, war. And I just wish we would all come together and fucking start a one world government. And I like the other guy, Corey Good. By the way, Donald Trump's amazing and I love him. Donald Trump. That's and they David tried. Wilcock. Corey Good. Not another one, dude. That's like this weird... I don't know why they tie... And then they're like, no, you're Q, but we're really Q. I don't know and... why they tie being a conspiracy theorist to Donald Trump. I don't like Donald Trump. I don't think, yeah. he, I don't think he's getting a fucking message from the aliens and he has... All right. I don't believe any of that. Right. I know. But they tell you that you have to. If they you tell you that's what it is. They say, well, they just tell you that's what it is. Yeah, Donald Trump's talking to the, he's so they, talking to the aliens, man. He's talking to the good aliens, and they are taking back control over from the bad aliens. That's so crazy. So you got to believe it. You got to believe if, it, okay, and we're going to band together against do, them. If you do believe that, then you have <laughs> to. Then that means that the default is everything that's regular. That's like mass media. Is the opposite. Mass media is the devil. Everything is the devil. Everything that's anti-Trump is the devil. Well, that's what they're trying to ask. That's crazy, crazy talk. <laughs> they try to get. Uh, <laughs> they try to get anti-Trump all the time, dude. Fucking MK Cinema. They just redid that. Uh, that movie is really good though. Above Majestic. Above they Majestic. give a lot of good information in there. They do. It's man, but yo, I am all about conspiracies, and I like yeah. it. And I fell asleep twice. It took <laughs> me three goes. Oh, that's because they're just feeding you bullshit. It took so, me so three. It's hard to goes. it's hard to to digest and yeah. and uh, and then okay, so then another MK <laughs> Cinema. Oh, oh, Jordan Slather. Okay, check him out. Destroy the illusion. Destroying the illusion. Destroying the illusion. YouTube. Yeah. Jordan Slather, Jordan Slather, 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 something. Just put Jay Slather. Yeah, just you oh, know, whatever. You know, he got censored. That's rude. Yeah, that's a weird ass thing. MK Cinema above Majestic. Boom, check it off. Okay. Bam, good movie. Central Go, Park, you can find it on that Hulu. Central Park Five, that Netflix. I don't even know what it's oh, called. Oh, the White Lady. But that's like the opposite. Instead of trying to tell the truth, that one mm-hmm. is trying to change the narrative or create a whole other narrative. Like, it, okay, well, I was trying to figure that out in my at head best, too. At best, it's trying. It is what happened. Right. It is what happened. What if they didn't have anybody? What if they didn't have anybody? Uh huh. Like they couldn't figure it out. They couldn't figure out who. I don't know the full. Where, I, where this, I don't know the full story. I don't know anything. What about I it understand either. the story is, uh, black kids hanging out. Right. Police pull up on them, arrest them. I'm sure smack them around, just be dicks. You know what right. I mean? Because they believe that these kids raped some lady, like gang right. raped her. Right. It totally didn't happen. And yeah, yeah, and they got proved innocent somehow, right. probably through fucking DNA. But or way later, later, yeah, they all went to jail. They are all proven guilty. I'm pretty sure, all five. Or well, then they got let out though later after they uh-huh. were found that it was right that they yeah they somebody went fucked jail up. Maybe like five years, ten years, maybe longer. You know, longer. That's just injustice system. It, Shitty it, injustice system. Man. So oh, the man. first I ever heard of that, we were alive, but we were kids. I think it was in the '90s, or maybe I think it was actually in the '80s, dude. I don't know. Yeah, but uh. The the whole, I never heard of it, but it was like one of these big famous cases, like court cases in the U.S. because the U.S. stinks like that, and they make that's weird. Yeah, they do entertainment like, out of oh fucking bullshit. So, <laughs> Doctor Phil, oh bullshit. So they love it. They love it. They love it. The first time I ever heard of the Central Park Five was when they brought it up when Donald Trump was running because he had spent a lot of money trying to get these guys like the court of public opinion, opinion uh-huh. trying to fucking. Right, he was trying to woo, guilty. woo over Yeah, the, trying to He's guilty, the he's guilty. So in the narrative that these guys are guilty, and a lot of people said it was racist, man. Uh, I wasn't alive, but I fucking bet, because that, yeah. was, that was around the time when Donald Trump was running the fucking uh, apartments with mm-hmm. his dad, and when right. people would do an application, dude, he would literally write just a fucking B if they were black. A B? A B. Not creative, not... 
don't hide anything, you know? They're like, oh, <laughs> yeah, no, you see a B, that means uh, an F. They failed. Uh, they don't move into my fucking buildings. And uh, he, he, they got sued uh, over that. And that's a proven, that's like the most proven thing. Oh, Donald Trump was a racist. Or maybe was, was his dad. Oh, yeah, whatever, dog. That shit don't die. Yeah. That fool's been well, the same for 40 years. Yeah, what is it? What what is it about these people that think that they can just uh, like kill everybody else and just do whatever they want? You gotta move that down. Oh, sorry, man. Uh, uh, you know what I mean? Like the, Donald Trump is like about? I'm talking about like people like Donald Trump that are just so fucking in the yeah. zeitgeist that they they don't they have no feel they have no emotion they have no regard for like the real human life and they just do crazy things just to get whatever they want to get done done yeah i don't know and they're don't like know. psychotic they're like literally yeah. psychotic yeah, i don't know the context but it looks pretty bad no context i just when mean you, no i don't know I who don't gets know. put into that kind of position know, to make those decisions a I, psycho i don't know the context but it looks pretty bad when you go back and look and this fool saying bring back the death penalty we, yeah. need, we need to have the death penalty maybe just once you know you know how he, like Dude, that's crazy, dog. That's going back that's in time. Insane. Dude, that's insane. You're not a fucking. Donald Trump uh, does not have a time machine, unless you're talking about a theoretical time machine. How he wants to go back in time to fucking. But maybe we don't. <laughs> Jim maybe, Crow but laws. Maybe we and... don't understand what the past is. Maybe like uh, back then he didn't have a time machine because only now he has a time machine. Right. Because he, there is no back then. And you say he doesn't want to. He's afraid to get inside of it, so he just let his son do it. Oh. I don't think Baron. So. No, dude, it's not a fucking. You go play with this. No, it's not. No, like, like that. a thing you get in. I don't think so. Oh, it's Oculus. Yeah, dude, a Palantir. Dun, oh, dun 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 dun. dun, dun. Damn. Wow. So yeah, that Central Park movie. It seems weird. I would like to know how much of it is true, how much of it is not. That lady was definitely racist. If yeah, they she... say that the guy that actually did it confessed. Yeah, later it, on, yeah. way later. So if that lady was like going hard, like no, she said she saw fucking these group of right. black kids. She's definitely racist, and then and then Why? she goes on to yeah. quit and start writing bullshit. Yeah, book start deal. writing fiction. Yeah, got a book deal. I got a book deal. Yeah, what was her net worth? I looked it up. It was twelve million. Really, as a prosecutor, somebody that's supposed to former be a justice. Yeah, whatever. Man. Former prosecutor, right. author. Writer, singer, songwriter, auditioner, now and practitioner, and social uh, pariah. Op. Yeah, opified. Boom. Got him. She had to step. Oh, Get your just, cheese straight. I want to talk about Zen Buddhism. I've dog. Had you wanna... Just enough of your Vassar <laughs> bashing, motherfucker. Vassar. Yeah, she she was <laughs> like on the board at Vassar. Yeah. She stepped down. I think Vassar is like a pretty like. Uh, like a liberal college, maybe. Okay. No, I actually think it's a conservative. One of those, college. Uh, well, liberal, like a, those liberal arts. Yeah, but it's actually really Private. conservative. Yeah, liberal arts, but it's a crazy fucking rich. That means it's uh, it's a rich den. It's uh, one of those. Um, what tank. do they do for the kids? Uh, Betsy DeVos is trying to do charter schools. Oh, yeah, that private private college yeah. is like ch- the charter schools of high school, like. Yeah. That, like do you go to how many does public you, school or God, could you imagine going to the same school <laughs> uh, for fucking twelve years? I went to a public university for twelve years. Can you imagine going to the same school as that? Do they have them like that? I bet you they do. Where it's like a twelve giant years compound, and this is it's like where the prison. little kids go, and then you get bigger and you just mob from building to building. Uh, it's like a fucking compound. And dude. You just stand on the conveyor belt until it drops you in the meat grinder. No, no, you have to run and do those fucking cadences. My fucking oh, bitch is a vegetable. Oh, oh, I got oh, in the hospital. That's a good one. Yeah, dog. Oh, I made I, I, dickheads. I got a song. Can I play it? No. Why? We're going to end on it. Okay. All right, here we go. Here we go. Yes, okay, go. Good. Central Park 5. We're out of here. That's crazy. Donald Trump needs to just be careful because you... You know, sometimes yeah, do uh, anything to anti-Trump, dude. That's yeah. Well, but that's in the past. You can't go. Those back guys to better have gotten fucking paid for that, dude. I Grab think. Grab them by the pussy. Netflix says that a lot. Oh, all right. You ready for the next op? Yeah. Opify op watch. Ooh. This is the op watch podcast. Nice. Good. Apple is Let's split. Get them all then. Is splitting up the podcasting, the music, and the movies. That's AKA crazy. Yeah. That's the, I don't compartmentalizing. D- yeah, they are hard compartmentalizing. Yeah, yeah dude. And no more monopoly. 
Trader Joe's has a podcast now. It's just like what the fuck are you gonna talk it's about? It's backwards. Let me talk about my lemons. <laughs> hey, we got some. By guys. the way, here I got some peanut brittle and. <laughs> you know what's bomb? Two buck chuck. Two buck chuck and the Whalers rum. They have some black, non-spiced. Okay, you can get some. Cr- <laughs> you can get some. I know you're not a big drinker. Okay, but you can get some Kraken. I am. I'm okay, I, I, I've heard that. You can get the Kraken. The Kraken, right? It's good because it's a black rum. Well, it's, it's not pirate. A, it's, it's not pirate a, drink. Right? right. Yeah. It's not as sweet. Rum's really sweet. That one's not as sweet. It has a spice to it. Cool. Okay, but oh, that yeah. motherfucker hurts. Oh, it gives you the Trader Joe's mud butt or something. Ooh, hard mud butt. Hot mud butt. Oh. Ooh, it's hot and black. Ugh. Oh. Oh. So hot Trader Joe's black coffee has a black rum that's not spiced. So oh. it's not as sweet. But just as fucking dark and good alcohol. Okay. Black rum. What's the percent? Bomb. 40. Just regular. 40%, 40 percent alcohol? 40 proof. Oh, okay. uh, no, no. That's Jesus. 80 proof. Yeah, 40% alcohol. Whoa. Okay, so pretty. Yeah, that's regular. So, that's rum. It's regular, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. okay. Most shit is like that. There's stuff higher, stuff is lower. Is it a different brand or it's or no, it's no, the no, store it's brand? A Trader Joe's oh, Whalers Rum, sh- baby. Whaler, man. It's like ten bucks, pretty cheap too. That <laughs> you real get real. You we real, did that hey, thing. He's like, you real get like a pirate. Remember when we were talking about uh, <laughs> we, yeah, living in a whale or something? Jonah in the whale. Oh right? man, shout out episode yeah. three or something. No, nobody knows about that one. Jonah in the whale. Oh, it's a forbidden podcast that <laughs> we, had, we had to delete. Moses was <laughs> uh, Jonah in the whale. Yeah, I don't know. So we'll, we'll see what Apple's going to do with the compartmentalizing. Yeah, that's pretty interesting, man. I think I don't know why they're doing that. Oh, that's what I was going to say. Is I that, think wait, it's uh, I think it's like they're doing it backwards, right? You just start one brand, mm-hmm. iTunes, Apple. It's well, yeah, and then all of a sudden you have iTunes, all these different things you do which with is it. Yeah, all of those put together. iTunes is its own thing now. No, iTunes is done. That's why they're doing this. They're going to iTunes is gone. get rid of iTunes and have three different separate apps. They're trying to like... Oh, no. Oh, you have Apple Music. Now it's no. Apple Movies, Apple Podcasts. Oh, man. You know, iPod. Or, oh, it's already a thing. Public service announcement. Throw your iPhone in the trash. Throw your iPod in the trash. Throw any of your Apple products in the trash. Not a dog. If you're... We, that sucks. They're in the spot. They're in the weed pocket too, man. Did you see? Uh, Android is not going to allow oh. any weed-related apps in the Play yeah. Store at all. Stupid. But it is easier. Android's easier to break, so you can have fucking da da da. I'm about to get a highway. We'll just hack. Yeah. I'm that. about to get a highway. A highway. <laughs> Illegal phone. Is it? Yeah. Fuck yeah. You didn't follow any of that going on? Oh, uh, that's what they're gonna catch the people that. Yeah. There's like, the tech community the the like independent tech community says there's no possible way that there can be these back doors built in for china to harvest your information through having a you know a f- what i don't understand okay this is where it gets me okay <laughs> the fucking phones, i know two people that have the highway highway but the phone phone dog the phones are made <laughs> in china already Right. So what is everybody talking about? Of They're course like, it's got a we fucking... We can't have a China-backed cell phone company in the U.S. But we can have our iPhones <laughs> that we use in the U.S. made in China? What are we talking about? <laughs> what reality are we in? That's crazy. It doesn't make sense. But that's the shit. That, that they say Huawei is like a pseudo-government... <sighs> Uh, well, da- they were data talking mining, about... yeah, and we can't have that here because they'll suck all our data and they'll spy on us, China. And people are like, "No, you would be able to tell based on the hardware or software or some shit like that." There's some kind of weird debate like that, <laughs> and it seems like the 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 government can't uh... say, "Yeah, you guys are right, you tech guys are right," but we can't tell you that we know that you're right. But, you know, we got to keep it under wraps and we're going to fix the problem and then say, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. how the government well, works. Well, I will say that that company. What did you tell me is about un- when the president comes to town? When the president comes to town? What does the Secret Service do? Oh, yeah. That's yeah. crazy. What happened with the company? Sorry, I mean, cut you off. Uh, was that? No, they have with the highway, the, the Henlin Highway, whatever the fuck, that phone company. Mm-hmm. And they make TVs, and mm-hmm. they do other. They make other shit too. Yeah, they make a lot of electronics. Yeah, it's just an electronics company. Yeah, but they also, but that they they is under investigation. 
Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. You know where Samsung is from? Samsung? Samsung from, nope, nope. North Korea. No, not North Korea. <laughs> regular Korea, regular. Just uh, regular Korea, that's fucked up. <laughs> South Korea. Got em. It's from South Korea. It's a Korean company. Oh, uh, that's funny. But, yeah, what would you tell me about the Secret Service? What do they do? Oh, uh, my Tell me God. the a good uh, Opify. Opify. Well, this is crazy, yeah, because I was like, they were talking about um, some, when, when the president has to go somewhere, like go to Japan or go to uh, another Texas? country. Dallas? Anywhere, dude. You want to go? In the 60, maybe 63. Okay. Dallas, Texas in 63. Oh, keep going. Okay. The president's got to go somewhere. They got to, uh, they send a bunch of people, Secret Service people, military people out there to scope, scope it out. Everything. So everything. Yeah, they get the roads. They take pictures. They know, they know the ins and, and outs how, of everywhere, the blind spots, the corners, the fucking anywhere you could possibly go. How long ahead? Uh, a variety of months. And what do you think? For months, <laughs> they fly back to D.C. every time? Uh, no. I think they live there. They stay there, yeah. You get a little job, maybe drive a little Uber. Could you imagine how easy it is now? How yeah. hard how hard it was back in the day when you, you know, you had to, like, have a regular job or you had to, like, just it, yeah. mob from place you to place? Like, what does that guy do? from place to place. Like, he comes here, he eats, he gets one beer, he leaves. Yeah. He comes here, he gets a Diet Coke, he gets a coffee, he leaves. Comes here, he works, he walks on the treadmill. He leaves. Yeah. I he comes that. here every that. single yeah, day. He walks his dog. Comes in here every day, buys the same drink. Mm-hmm. Leaves. Yeah. Says thank you very much. Yeah. yeah. Leaves. Or you get a fucking gangster one. Oh, yeah, what does this guy do? He orders weed. He smokes weed and yeah. hangs out. Oh, wow, that's crazy. Oh, he's got a fake family. Oh, He's got a fucking fake family, fake business. Oh, oh, he's not even f- real. We got a fucking. He's not even real. Woo! He's a clone. Spook. He's a spook. Yeah, so they say. You ever seen a Burn After Reading? That's a good MK oh. cinema. Oh, it's kind of dry. It's really dry humor. Burn not, After Reading. There's no big like laugh out Man. loud, laugh that's out loud a parts. Thing to say. Yeah, Burn After Reading. That's crazy, huh? Yeah, I get rid of the knowledge. Yeah, that's that's, that's to tell you what the movie's about. But yeah, it's crazy. This fucking guy. He's like a, a, a bureaucrat, like an agent, but he's not like high up there. But he writes like this memoirs and kind of like makes it bigger, like he is high up there. And he's like, oh. maybe I'll turn it to a book. He's like real indecisive, like kind of a pussy. Yeah. And some people find it and they think it's like fucking like highly classified. <laughs> so they start trying to like sell it or perfect, just trying to benefit off of it, and it makes everybody all fucked up. Oh, that's hilarious. Yeah, it's that's all. Crazy. Yeah. But one guy actually accidentally shoots another guy. Like, he's like, Uh-oh. somebody's in my house, and he just blows his fucking head off, dude. Oh. And this guy is not a fucking agent, but he's he he dressed as one, personating an agent. So oh he got a God. suit, right? He thought he was. Uh-huh, and he, he right before he went in, he looked at his wallet, he goes, oh, shit, and he takes out, like, his ID and shit. <laughs> so when this guy shoots him in the head, right, just this regular guy who thinks that he is being spied on, he's <laughs> like, oh, my God. They're spying on me. I'm going to hide in the closet. Who is it? And this guy comes in. He's, and he's like, like, oh, there's somebody him. spying on me. I... And he fucking, blow, Bam. shoots the guy. It's his friend. It's, he didn't know him, but they're oh. connected somehow. I don't know. It's, that's the movie, uh, okay. you know, how connected they are. But he goes to his pockets, and he finds his, his uh, wallet that has nothing in it. He goes, he's a fucking spook. <laughs> he like, fucking runs out of the house and shit. Legit. And this guy, uh. he's like, I think he's a retired agent, but he's just he uses it to bang chicks. He's just like trying to oh. fucking bang everybody. Yeah, that's wife. not a bad idea. Yeah, yeah. So he's pretty well, not well meaning, but he's not like trying he's to like, get yeah. government secrets. By the way, yeah. by the way, girl. I'm in the. I'm in the. I'm in the I work for. I work for. I work, I work, for, work the, for them. I work for the capital work T for, them. Capital T. Do. Boom. All right, dude. Or the big eye, but you never. Nobody knows what that Ooh, means. I like. I don't like. Them. <laughs> E3 is this weekend. Dog. Right. Um, Pikmin. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you're excited about. Yeah. Pikmin. Well, or Animal Crossing. All right. That's for the Nintendo Switch. That's pretty cool. Well, I want to see it because yeah. I, I think I, I like the the uh, the I, the concept behind it. It's like Animal Crossing is like The Sims, mm. but kind of dumbed down. Ooh. So it's not quite as like. Oh, okay. It's I didn't literally know that. like yeah, you get go, you build a house, you get a job. 
you literally get a job. That's funny. And then you put you the uniform on, you go, you, you go off and you do different things, and yeah, you can build your house, and then you upgrade your house, and you fix up your house. If you don't take care of your house, you get cockroaches. That sucks. It's like life. Yeah. And then uh, <laughs> you, have all, <laughs> you have all these uh, other little creatures that you interact with, and then they have houses, right? And then you can work out business deals with them, right? And then eventually you can get a statue of yourself put in the center of the town. You could become the mayor. That's I think you crazy. work with the mayor. The mayor's a turtle. Turtle mayor? Yeah. <laughs> That's cool. That game is really cool. Yeah. Pikmin, Pikmin's a little bit more advanced, but I like the physics of that game where you just, Pikmin. You Pikmin. Just swing the guy. You're the little... I know Pikmin. The little I'm aware. Astronaut? Tell yeah. me what you know. Yeah, and he has this but little you, antenna, and these little bangers follow him around. The flim flower. Yeah, yeah. They follow him around, and they different ones do different shit, and... He's got the fire, the red one, and the yeah. and the blue ones. Mm-hmm. But you know what? Because he's small, right? He's like like less than the size of a uh, soda can. Yeah, so. yeah. He's the size of a pick. But so the whole environment is like Earth, like a real environment, but it's like down at... Oh, Honey, we shrunk the kids. Honey, honey I shrunk, I shrunk, honey, the, I shrunk the Olimar. Uh, Olimar. Oh, you can be him on Smash. That's where he's yeah, from. Yeah, Olimar. Oh, and what's his man. friend's name? Uh, I don't know. He's got a friend. Dickless. In the, in the second one. Olimar and Dickless. Yeah, I hate that game. I'll never play that game again. But, Why? You know, good. No, not oh. Pikmin. Smash Brothers. Oh, yeah. yeah they yeah, got yeah. you. Yeah, I'll never do it again. What? Uh, Why? Uh, it's too, I just don't get it. I don't, <laughs> I don't like the physics. It's too... Sometimes you The one for the GameCube was better. Sometimes you move slow. Yeah. That's dumb. Uh, E3, it seems like Xbox is going to have... They're it's gonna like win. taking over. Well, Sony's like not even there. I guess I didn't really know that. I always wait till the fucking like right before to get the news because yeah. the people running the fucking thing don't know what they're gonna do until that no. week. Dude. Well, they, they probably have, do that on purpose too. Yeah, because you they're can't like, have leaks and right. this and Somebody, that. Somebody only one person knows, and they're waiting until the. And sometimes the shit's not ready. You look like a fucking yeah. idiot. You know, <laughs> like the Diablo. Get that glitch out of there. Have you ever seen that? Get a big ass bug. Yeah, yeah. Sure. Fallout 76, dude. Oh. Yeah. But Bethesda the, always has bugs in their shit. Yeah. But that's Bethesda. because I don't think they give a fuck, dude. They're like, nope, putting it out anyways, and it'll get fixed later. It's crazy. They did that with Anthem. And that's Fallout what I'm 76, saying. That's what I'm huh? saying. I, so people talking about it for fucking three weeks and months on end, these fucking guys are flying off the cuff, dog. They're yeah. fucking shooting from the hip. Yeah. They don't know what the fuck is ready. The yeah. guy that's programming it is like, dog, I know you're waiting on me. I yeah. know. Yeah. So fuck you. Yeah. Right? You can't do it without me. He's right. like getting fucking grandma's boy, dog, with the fucking, you can't see me. How did they see me? <laughs> that shit. Just and they vector, don't know. Dude. And they, like the Diablo, have you ever seen that? They made a bunch of memes out of it. Everybody was like literally at the conference paying people, like the diehard fans. Went to this conference and everybody was expecting a brand new console game. Okay. Right to put with to a game Diablo, which is like a, some top down League of Legends, like it's old school League of Legends, you know. And it's, it's it looks so bad. It's not like, good. How pump those out, dog? How can you not pump those out? That seems like technically it's fucking easy as balls. Yeah. Get some new gameplay. Just get add characters, add yeah. whatever the fuck, add different Skyrim. missions. Skyrim, dog. Yeah, Skyrim's the same cool. shit. Just Elder add... Scrolls Six. That's what they say. But Diablo, they were there, and then they said, "We got a mobile game with in-game purchases." Oh fuck off! For your dog. cell phone. Yeah, literally, people. This one guy is so corny. This is how corny gamers are, dog. <laughs> this guy stands up <laughs> and he goes. I know it's not the right month, but is this a April Fool's joke? It's so corny. Oh my god! Just you know, they were dog, people were like pretty much booing that fool to this to his face, like wow. boo. We wanted a real game. This is not a real game. It's not a real game. And they were like trying their hardest up there, like no, it's gonna be cool, and you can buy in-game stuff as well. Two dollars and three dollars. <laughs> you know, like give me the micro purchases. Your, give me the tokens, give me the dog. Money, I dog. need the yeah, fucking you need the gems. I need the gems so that I can get myself on the list, dog. Yeah, that was like the biggest no good gaming moment for a long time. So hopefully nobody does what? that this weekend. You know, yeah. don't top that. Just don't do that. Just don't do that. 
No what? more in-game purchases. Well, Google, what was it called? Safari or something? No, it's called like Stry- Strider or something. Str- Google, Google Gaming. Google is going to start their own Google, Google platform. Like, they're going to have a console or it's just going to be like... I think it's like an online platform. It's like a streaming service. Dreamcast? Uh, yeah, real Dreamcast. You know, to where if you can just get it on your phone you and VR, you plug it into the VR right, thing. Right, so it's just going to be a bunch of... In, and I think the Samsung... In-game purchases and... Yeah, <laughs> a bunch of trials, dog. How good, Try this game. How many trials have we you tried? We got Bubble Blaster 5. We got 16 trials for you. <laughs> you only get to play level one. Yeah. This is a car driving trial. This is a truck driving trial. <laughs> this is a walking oh. a tightrope. This is walking a tightrope in a circus. This one is out <laughs> in a city. <laughs> you know? What's the what best VR game? game? What is that? The uh, barroom brawl? No, no, no. Is that Oh, the, that? The, that, this that is probably the best. Yeah. Hilarious, man. Just smash someone over the head with something. Hilarious. Uh, but no, the what's that uh there's a game. There's a game that is really f- Okay. You know the Burnout? You ever heard that game, Burnout? Burnout. Yeah, I played. Last one I played was Paradise. I think that might have been the last one, dude. That one was pretty good. Is that the one they have? That's the, the newest you, one. You, uh, I think so. And you? It's really fast. Yeah, and you're kind of not supposed to crash, but it's okay to crash, and then yeah. like, make a you're big not animation be, out yeah. of it. It's kind of yeah. cool. Yeah. Okay. Definitely. Yeah, yeah. That, I hope that those guys keep making more games because I you know, know that's like a big thing. I watch a lot of those. I like those ones that list. Best Dude, franchises back in the day, there was this game. Come back. <laughs> there was this game on uh, the Nintendo sixty four called Blast Core, or Blast, Blast Corpse, uh, but it's not corpse because it's yeah, core. Yeah. Because yeah, yeah. you work for the army. Oh no! But no, no, it My was just a, a vegetable. <laughs> but it was just a. Uh, it was like you get to drive all these different trucks around, you know, and you just like it was just random and crash and blow shit, shit up and like, yeah, really weird. There's this game that's pretty good. It was free for a while on the PlayStation. You should download it. Uh, on Rush. On Rush. Yeah, that was a pretty good racing game, and it was kind of the same deal. Where it was okay to crash, and you yeah. fucking smash people and a Rush. Could, Remember Rush? Hit them off. It might have been like a a, a spinoff of that. On Rush. I don't know. That's cool. Mm-hmm. Oh man, I remember they had that stunt level where it was like flips. And shit. Yeah, it was just like ramps and and uh. just like loop de loops and shit, and you just drive your car around and and yeah. you get points for the different stunts. You barrel do a barrel mm. roll, you know. You know, low key, what became one of the fucking coolest little weird stage driving games was Grand Theft Auto Five. If yeah. you go online, there's some crazy fucking they have levels. The, yeah, you yeah you actually showed me that before. It's insane, dude. That it's was... like you're flying through the sky. I like that trucks versus rockets, dog. <laughs> you know, yeah. you have to hit yeah. the ramp just right That's crazy. in order to take somebody out. Boom. But they have unlimited rockets and they can blow your ass up, dude. That oh. shit is so fun. I have the one where they just roll down the hill. Yeah. You don't hit the balls. Right. They'll don't explode hit... or bowling. Yeah. That shit's so crazy. They had the hardcore park. Gonna more. have to do that. that I forgot shit is so about hard. that. Grand Theft Auto is one of the games. It's rewarding when you get over the fucking. I fence wish that they so to the fighter jet. I'm not and saying start just shooting everybody like I'm, yes. I'm not saying that I think that uh, <laughs> Grand Theft Auto will make you like a violent person. Mm-mm. Right. I don't think it will, but that's no, like a common misconception. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But yeah, you, you rob people, right? You shoot up the liquor store. You. Could, I know. Like get a crack house. Get, get a, a prostitute. That's mm-hmm. the first thing yeah. everybody says about Banger. the game. And what? It's funny. Is it? Yeah. When it's like, uh, uh, especially when they <laughs> really made a joke at the first time they did it. Like now, it's a little bit like, oh, I may or may not <laughs> have jerked off in high school to that real quick. <laughs> you know, you bust a quick thirty second nut. You know, that it's was the, grand the, theft auto. That was the best. But oh, that was the best. <laughs> Uh, the best nut I ever bust was Grand Theft Auto in the Grand fifth Th- grade. Yeah. <laughs> you got to real quick, as soon as you pick her up, you got to find a place to park. Right. No. Stay still. Does that sound violent to Don't you? step on the gas pedal because then she'll... Yeah, she'll jump out. Yeah, she was going uh, to... But, but you got to like... You always had to run her Don't over. let her jump out. Yeah, don't... And then get Well, if she tries back. to get out, you got to kill her, yeah. yeah. and get your money back. Even right. if you were happy with it and you needed the life, you still had to get your money back. It's capitalism. You got kill her. Yeah. Jesus... <laughs> Capitalism. Yeah. Is bad. Maybe they designed that game to That's see so like bad. That's so bad. What? <laughs> <laughs> Why did they make that game? That was Rockstar, man. They were 
he come up with some really. I'm going really, to take my house to the old town road. My house. <laughs> take my house. I didn't. I don't want to play Rockstar. that Red Dead Redemption. I'm not. It looks, I'm not doing it. It looks too slow for me. I told my mom I wanted that game for Christmas, and then she gave it to she me. Gave it to my brother. <laughs> That's. And funny she said, "Oh, shit. he was so happy too." Yeah. And and I was like, said, "Oh, like, you realize that game is not? He's he's like 13 years old. He's not supposed to play that game." Yeah. I, he's, you shoot people. You're a cowboy in that game, or something like that, right? Yeah. That's the games for me. Remember, I told you to buy that for me. Actually, I was with you at the game I'm store. Said, Wait, what game do you and, want? And then That's she said, "Well, I can take it back from him and give it to you." I said. No! A Christmas morning. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh yeah. This is the happiest kid in the world. You get this one. Fucking. <laughs> yeah, here you go. Golfing simulator, dog. <laughs> just like the Farming s- simulator, like dude. We Simpsons. got it on sale for three ninety nine at Walmart. Yeah, it came free. In the bin, dude, because I didn't <laughs> want to ask the lady to open the case. That's fucking ridiculous. That's pretty funny. But okay, but yeah, okay. So if it's not Pikmin or Animal Crossing, what game are you excited oh, about? Oh, I want the playable demo of Final Fantasy VII. Oh, that is gonna be good. And uh, that's gonna be good. I don't know if it's the same studio, dude. I just wish that they wouldn't do the like ooh twenty thirty. But that's, that's like, like Skyrim. No. Yeah, it is. No, 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 Skyrim. But they don't show the little like how many times you. But that's just fighting. That's just fighting. There's a bunch right. of the other. There's a. It kind of shows. You know, like when you do Pokemon, around. dude. The old Pokemon games, just like. That's, that's how the old Final Fantasy VII was. I know. Yeah. I hate it. No. Can't stand that. No. I don't want to sit there. Shit! You literally you had to pause and take a like. Me, Every me, second was a pause. About it. Let me think about it. But no, 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 because the guy will keep going. He'll keep going. He'll keep fucking you up. He ain't waiting for you. He'll hit you. For, if you sit there and don't do anything, this fool's not going to be like, well, right, okay. it's not my In turn. In Final Fantasy? Yet. Yeah. Okay, he okay. Be like, it's not my turn. He'll fuck you up. Right. He'll just keep hitting you. It just seems like it was like a pause in the game. Do, 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 you know? do. It's like, it is like a fight. Well, it is because if you hit him hard enough, then all three of your guys will hit him. And then yeah. you get like a special power. All it's just like another video game, so you know. Yeah, RPG. Yeah. I think that what and was it's the, so what's cool? Dude, MMO. Know, it's different. That's like massive online. multiplayer online. Okay, that's yeah. different. Yeah, okay, RPG but RPGs. Is that's what role playing game. The Skyrim. That's Final that's the Fantasy. Same shit. It's no, like, uh, Skyrim's <laughs> a are playing a role playing game. No, no, I think uh, it's no. the same exact thing. No, I put it in a different category. No, no, what? I think it's gonna go in the uh, hack and slash. First and third person game. RPG. Mm, uh, adventure just style. Just look up. Uh, just look up. Look at. Here we just go. adventure style. Um, RPG. No. Um, adventure style. Uh, <laughs> Buttness. Uh, quest. Quest driven. Quest lore. Right, uh, here we go. Sky. Rim. Skyrim. Adventure. Yeah. Adventure. Uh, uh, action. Action. Is an action role playing video game. Literally, the second word after it says that. <laughs> it doesn't say RPG though. So. Oh yeah, but what does uh, RP, RPG stand for? Uh, like red. Red <laughs> pongos. <laughs> red. Bam. Red pogo sticks. Yeah, Final Fantasy VII. Hopefully, cool. Something on that one. I think they're trying to do like an episodic thing. That sucks. I hope they just oh. out the whole game because that's a it's a long yeah. game. It was three discs. That story just goes on forever. What's uh, it about? It's about uh, really you save the princess. No, the Great Awakening. Oh, there is. And you got to find the. There's a meteor coming to kill everybody. At the same time, there's a guy that is tapped into the evil of the world that is becoming a giant force in the world, and oh. everybody is kind of doing his bidding. Oh. And he's he's kind of calling the meteor to Earth. Uh oh. The North Pole. Yeah. And he's like become like half of the earth. When you finally, you think like there's so many flashbacks where he's all fucking cool. Sephiroth, right? He yeah. He has a super long sword and the trench coat. Yeah. And then you get to him and he's like some fucking morphed up monster. Some bullshit. Oh. Uh. It sucks, dude. But the whole story is cool. But yeah, that's it. And there's, you know, you explore the world. There's this like crazy gambling shit. I think okay. uh, gambling Star yeah Star Star Wars Shh. when they were in the casino yeah. they really ripped off of that nice Final Fantasy Republic. Final Fantasy Seven dude they stole that from Final Fantasy yeah. I guess gambling's pretty big in space why do they want us to believe that what the fuck yeah 
That's weird. <laughs> racist space and gambling. Space casinos? Space You have to gambling. be racist in space because you have to tell well, the different species all the, apart. Right, you have these different, different currencies races. and different... Like, yeah, they'll You never you. know if the, if the, if the Syrian... Uh, People cut that? your head off. Yeah, you, you're dark. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. You know, you could be sitting there. Uh, chill as fuck, wrong. right? But you don't speak. Don't Gungla. sit on their left side or some shit. Right, yeah, you'll sit on his left side, it's against his religion, and yeah. then he's like, if people do that to me, then I'm going to... Yeah, you got to be racist in space. His throat. That sucks. News you can use, you got to be racist in space. It sucks. <laughs> uh, but yeah, that's what Final Fantasy wow. is about. Yeah, pretty much. And cool. then you, well, have, yeah, to, you have to learn, and there's like, you know, good and evil, and awakening. I, I, you know, I played it when I was a kid, so I'm sure a wow. lot of it fucking flew over my head, but there was a big old I casino... Like that. Like at the top of a mountain, dog, and you ride okay. these big old ostriches, chocobos, o- o- chicken ostriches, called okay. chocobos. Chocobo. And you, dog, you ride it and breed them and race them. So breed there was them. you breed them. There was a breeding, a whole section in the thing where you go to the farm, and if you get certain eggs and feed them certain shit, it creates certain chocobos. You get a rainbow chocobo. Oh goddamn! Unlimited sprint, dog. You're just running, oh, cranking the dough out, dog. Just balling. Final Fantasy stole the rainbow. Uh, oh, that's yeah. just a that's Japanese thing or something. Well, go, they know Japanese. They go love rainbow colors. And, you know. Yeah. I would love, my buddies went to Japan. Sonic the Hedgehog when he gets the stars, but those are the he, that's the stars. Hey, that's a free game this month. Sonic? PlayStation Sonic Mania. Yeah, they kind of oh, they kind of redid it. Mm-hmm. And it was pretty. Oh, it, downloaded really quick. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna get that. Yeah, you need that. Sonic the Hedgehog is fun. Yeah, and those free games every month, dude, you can keep them and download them anytime. It's pretty cool. It's oh, like, I why like not that. fucking just expand the library? If you have PlayStation yeah. Four, if you're pay for the online, which everyone does because you have to, the, you get free games every month. Like probably two, I think it's two games. That's sometimes really three cool. Games every month. No, they gotta tell more you people. That's a good thing you're telling everybody. Yeah, all you do is just click it, and you have it puts the license into your library. So you can download it at any time because you need to have the license okay. in, your, in your thing. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, I got my PlayStation from somebody else, and she had a bunch of uh, already downloaded games, games huh? or she just had the license on the on her profile. So when I oh, deleted shit. her profile off, I lost all those games. Oh and I was no! I like, damn, I would have just left them and just switched back just and forth. Download the game. What? Well, no, you the license is was linked to her account. Oh not yeah. Not mine. Yeah. So I got all mine back yeah all trophies and shit dog they keep track of everything yeah uh, <laughs> they want to know how good you are at the at the video game at the video game at because the, the combat simulator all right close well, for lunch give me give me another one give me a quick one 30 seconds what do you feel about the something uh yeah <laughs> the only thing i have left is ufc what you got ufc you don't know nothing about i UFC. don't know nothing That's but i don't want to get punched i have seen a couple funny videos of these people getting knocked out like this one guy tried to steal this guy's motorcycle and and the guy's like he's on the motorcycle wearing the helmet trying to leave and the guy's like trying to throw him off the motorcycle so yeah. he can steal it right he's like drunk or something right yeah. and the guy on the motorcycle gets off of the motorcycle puts the fucking kickstand down and whops the fool and his homie bam bam knocks them both out right there <laughs> and then leaves on his motorcycle away. that's crazy <laughs> and he had his helmet on the whole time <laughs> That's crazy. Even if they wanted to punch back, dude, he had a helmet on. Yeah. <laughs> are you going to punch well, a guy you, with a fucking helmet Yeah, on? I don't know. What are you going to do? Hit oh, him with a bummer. Get him with a good old body <laughs> shot. Yeah. Oh, I'll just start slapping it. You know how loud it hilarious. is when you slap a helmet and you're wearing that shit? It is loud. That's the only thing about UFC I know is, man. That was don't UFC steal my motorcycle related talk. <laughs> <laughs> Bam. Tony Ferguson coming for the... He, they, they're going to win Holy this. Holy water. Right? It's got bugs in it. Whoever wins this... Right is lined up with Kalabib <laughs> and Dustin Poirier. Right, Dustin okay. Poirier is Theo Vaughn's homie. Okay, I guess they're from both from Louisiana or something like that. They have some tie and they're homies. Okay, right. Uh, he's fighting Kalabib in like September, and the winner of that is probably gonna fight the winner of Saturday. Who? Tony Ferguson and this other guy, Cowboy Cerrone. Cowboy. Yeah, oh, he's yeah. really. I like him a lot. I like Cowboy him a lot. Cowboy yeah, He's like super fan favorite. He's fighting Tony Ferguson. Yeah, it's really. It's it sucks trying to like. Oh man, usually you're like, fuck. I don't even know this guy. I don't give a fuck about him. I like this guy, but you know, both these guys are both like fucking superstars. They're both cool. Super cool as fuck. Yeah. Gotta go, Tony. Dog, throw some fucking holy water. Throw on some him. holy water on him, dog. He, yeah. Tony They're f- listening to me through the walls. Tony Ferguson was getting gang stalked. They were fucking listening to everything he did. Or he was convinced they were listening to everything he, he did. He knew. 
He knew. He knew. He knew. Maybe he put an implant in his leg. Dog. Dog. I don't know what that stuff means. Yeah, whatever. We're out of here. Tony Ferguson for the W. Woo, 27, dog. This episode ah, was in 27 was good. You got me, dude. I got you got you. me on a lot of those don't things. Don't go guapo guapo. Don't. Don't go to the Dominican Republic. Jesus, we're going to have to put a fucking security alert on this one, dude. All-inclusive vacation. Keep your knives protected by your canisters. Do not go no. to the Dominican Republic right now. Something weird's going on. Uh, episode 27. Appify. Close for lunch. Donald Trump's wait, 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 Donald wait, wait, Trump wait. said we can't go to Cuba either. Oh, damn. He did say that on huh? his tariffs. And Mexico. They're putting shit on like... Mexico. Well, uh, we have to learn more before oh, we talk wow, about wow, that. Wow. I need the weed song. Oh, this is a new song. Yeah. You want to hear my new song? I almost forgot about this. Thank you. Appreciate it. This song was made entirely by Cotton Mouse. Yeah.